really was a visionary, and, and to his credit, he knew his customers. In the garment center, that was, you know, it was all about what you were wearing, the label, the style. It wasn't about the five cent cigar. You would, you would wear a cigar, a cigar would be an accessory, and, and what that band was, was important, and, and he realized that. And as he went on, and you know, we started developing our own lines of cigars, we were never gonna be that, that, that middle range cigar. It was always gonna be on the upper end from a price range, from a quality perspective. The move to 7-Eleven Fifth Avenue was, was visionary. I mean, who would put a cigar store on, on Fifth Avenue? And it really not only said something about him, but it also said so much about the brand and what that brand, what our brand stood for and what the name stood for. What the store became was, was equally as visionary for, for the industry. It was probably the first store with the lounge that not only could you buy a cigar, but we wanted you to stay, to, to be part of it and to celebrate it. That was really, unheard of at the time.